Hi guys, how are you all doing? Welcome back to my channel. This is Style Like On That at the Lifestyle Collective bringing you TLC, Tender Loving Care. It's been a while since we last touched base. Um, yes, a lot has happened and I think my last video was, my last vlog was during the first um, lockdown when in fact I was working on my new eco-friendly range, Shades and Coffee. You know, so for those of you who may not know, I have worked as a stylist, celebrity stylist, personal shopper for many years. Prior to the pandemic, I was working on uh, a new product uh, for a year and a half. I didn't want just a product, I wanted a product with a difference, with a unique selling point. Everything else was in place. My personal shopping business, Style Icon, which I set up in 2005. I then went on to launch my blog, The Lifestyle Collective, which focuses on fashion and beauty in 2016. And there was just a gap there for something else, being a product. Um, and um, hence why I launched Shades and Coffee officially. So, you know, things have changed since then. You know, I've found that uh, with regards to the fashion industry, there's been a huge kind of shift in mindset uh, such that, you know, consumers are, you know, buying into more sustainability, um, you know, recycling, um, and they're more kind of environmentally aware. Um, and so I've had to kind of, I guess, Yes, readjust my business model and yes I still personal shop for clients um, but you know I wanted to I guess you know the key thing is to well for me anyway was to generate passive income um, and I did actually sell and I did sell um, quite a number of t-shirts um, during the first lockdown um, so I guess let me take you back um, to, you know, how Shades and Coffee started, you know, the, the, the thinking behind it. Um, and you can in fact read more about my brand story um, on my blog, styleiconnats.com. You know, years ago, I mean, I had many jobs, you know, I was constantly on the go. Um, and I remember talking to a colleague at the time and, you know, talking about, as you do, your dreams, aspirations. I mean, who would have thought what all the world would be as it is now? But, you know, that's how the cookie crumbles. Um, so we'll talk about our aspirations. And um, I remember my colleague saying, you know, I think you should write a book one day. And then he kind of somehow, like, mentioned, like, Shades and Coffee. And then the name stuck since then. And I was like, you know, and, and when it came to uh, you know, thinking of a product, building upon a product brand, a name, then the same name came back to me, you know, it kind of resonates, it has a, a ring to it. Um, and that was pretty much, you know, as it says on the tin, you know, your shades, coffee, and that kind of summed up, you know, my, my life then. I was constantly wearing sunglasses, um, you know, like tired, on the go, constantly drinking coffee. So, you know, Shades of Coffee is a lifestyle, really. It's a lifestyle brand. And um, when it came to doing my research, I mean, it did in fact take a good year and a half, by the way, before I launched the brand, took a year and a half to do field research, um, product research, um, desk research in terms of uh, logo design, fabric composition, manufacturers, so on and so forth. Um, and I thought, how can I apply this name? What can I apply it to? Um, what type of product? And then I thought, well, actually, a T-shirt is a great place to start because, number one, everyone wears T-shirts, um, whatever the, uh, I guess, weather. But, you know, even in winter, you can layer a T-shirt. In the summer, you can wear it as is with a pair of jeans. Um, and, you know, in fact, I did recently um, provide some commentary to Stylist magazine about you know, outfits appropriate or weather appropriate outfits. Um, and I did include uh, a reference to like a t-shirt. So then I linked that to the, the concept of Shades and Coffee, I guess, being a lifestyle brand. Um, it incorporates uh, the feel good 
um, and look good factor and also brings in style. Uh, so sunglasses, for example, meaning shades. Um, I know shades is very much used in, in, in the States, I think, but um, I thought, wow, you know, sunglasses, they're elegant, they're classic. Um, you know, these are, they, we wear sunglasses every day. And, you know, it's all, also an ambiguous style. Because think about it, you know, when you're tired, you're hungover, you're on the school run, uh, funeral, wedding, you know, we wear shades, but then, you know, they kind of hide the windows to our soul. So very ambiguous, but yet a classic style. And then I thought, well, you know, what's our kind of go-to everyday staple or thing um, that makes us feel good? And I thought, oh, actually, I love coffee. You know, I drink coffee every morning. It's a great energy booster. You know, it's big in London, LA, Italy, Asia, the list goes on. So I thought this is actually quite a genius concept. You know, I love it and it's relatable. Everyone can relate to shade, coffee and a t-shirt. <laughs> so there you go. Bob's your uncle, the Eureka moment. Um, then I started to do some more research into manufacturers. Um, and, you know, in terms of like field research, I remember like uh, attending an Excel um, exhibition. In fact, it was a hemp uh, CBD um, product exhibition. And, and, you know, back then, two years ago, you know, hemp products, CBD, cannabidiol were growing in popularity. And then I thought, wow, there's something here. Um, once again, I want a high quality product. So what will people buy? Will they buy just a t-shirt? Is that enough? No. Fabric composition, quality, the feel of a product, how it feels on your skin, how it looks, how it drapes. So I remember speaking to attendees. I thought I'm in the right place. Why not speak to attendees um, who I got to complete um, a, a survey? Um, and once I collated my information, I, I saw that hemp was, you know, a, is a huge, huge selling point, a unique selling point. Um, so I brought kind of everything together and then I began the manufacturing process, researching into manufacturers. Um, and I found a UK manufacturer uh, who offered t-shirts in 100% hemp. But then, the further I delved into my research, I, I saw that, you know, hemp manufacturers are few and far between in the UK. Um, the production run would take a good five to six weeks in their mill abroad, ironically. You know, it, it's not financially viable. And, you know, for any new businesses, for new business owners, you know, it's so important to really be mindful of your costings and, like, make the right business decisions and financial decisions. And I found a, a US manufacturer in the end um, who offer, like, beautiful T-shirts with a fantastic drape. I'm wearing one of them now actually, and it feels great. Um, my t-shirts come in white and black, and you know, the fabric composition is, you know, it's a beautiful blend of 60% organic hemp viscose with 40% organic blended cotton at 4.3 ounces per yard. And all products are certified, got certified, meaning the global, organic textiles standard. My, my products also adhere to the organic blended cotton standard, which verifies the amount of organic blended cotton in a final product. Lastly, my product range also adheres to the global recycle standard, which is a um, voluntary uh, product standard that tracks and verifies the um, content in recycled material in a finalized product. So I did my research. You know, I was very much hot on quality. Shades and Coffee Apparel is also recognized by PSEG Energy Efficiency 
programs as a green business. Yes, I have everything shipped over from the States to here, to London, to the UK via FedEx, but they're also working towards lowering their aircraft emissions and adhere to environmental sustainability. Ultimately, Shays and Coffee puts the fun back into functional fashion, you know? It makes you look good, feel good. That's what I want for you guys. I want you to feel good in my product with a pair of shades, a cup of coffee, and your t-shirt, of course. So guys, you can check out the links below to the shadesandcoffee.com website. You'll find us on Instagram and Twitter, shades and dot coffee on Instagram. Please leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And I'll speak to you soon. Peace out. Bye for now.